very special, and I'm so happy you guys made it because I know the roads are crazy out there. So welcome. Uh, we're talking about a new Canadian comedy. It's called Dr. Cabby. It tells the story of a young Indian doctor who moves to Toronto looking to help others. Unable to find a way to practice medicine, he starts driving a cab, turning the taxi into a roving doctor's office where he treats his riders. Comedy ensues. This is the brainchild of actor-writer Vinay Vermani. The movie mixes Indian and Canadian cultures and is the result of a delightful rom-com. You guys, I had the chance to see it on Monday. And both Vinay and co-star Isabel Kapp are here to tell us a little bit more about the movie. Welcome, you guys. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you so much for having I us. I apologize for the weather. It's okay, but the people are so warm in Calgary that it totally makes, makes up. up for it. Oh, so. good. Okay, we're happy to hear that. Now, let's talk a little bit about the premise of the movie, and this is your idea. How did you come yeah, up with it? Yeah, well, the idea started from taking a cab ride in Toronto mm -hmm. where my cabbie was a doctor in India yeah. and uh, he told me his whole story which really moved me and it's a story we hear all too often not only about doctors but lawyers engineers mm -hmm. um, you know immigrants who come over and you know their skills don't kind of translate over and, and what that means for them you mm -hmm. know and how uh, hurtful that can be so uh, he told me his story and he said something really simple to me which is that I just came here to heal people mm -hmm. and they won't let me do that here mm -hmm. And I thought you know, about this idea for a young man who doesn't need a clinic. He can open up his own clinic in the back of his cab. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, the truth is today that Canada needs more doctors. We have a doctor shortage. Mm -hmm. We have millions of people without a family doctor. And uh, that's where Dr. Cabby comes in. And this is a topic that you delved into, but it is a comedy. It is, absolutely. It's a lot of fun. We have a crazy cast. Uh, there's a lot of cross-cultural comedy. You know, we kind of pick at each other's stereotypes a bit. and. Uh, you know, I'm happy Isabel is here with me as well. And, yes, so but beautiful. unfortunately, she's, she's not opposite me. She's opposite that Kamal man that you Maya. just saw, or who played Raj <laughs> on Big Bang Theory. So. Yeah, a lot of people will recognize Kanal, of course, from Big Bang Theory, as you mentioned. And tell us about getting him on board with the cast. Were you guys friends before? You know, we had known each other a little bit. Uh, but uh, when I was writing the film, I only saw him in, the, in, in this character. And everybody was like, his character... Are you sure he can pull this off? Because on the show, he's like the biggest nerd of all time. Right. But in this movie, he's this crazy cabbie. He drinks, he parties, he does not need alcohol to talk to women. She no, can tell no, you he that. doesn't. He's, <laughs> he's such a player, a player in this movie. And, and everybody's like, no way. Like, I mean, you know, let's talk about, you know, let's talk to somebody else. I'm like, no, something in my heart tells me that this guy's going to do the it. Guy. And he read the script and he loved it. And we're just both so happy that he's mm -hmm. a part of it. Yeah. And you had the chance to play opposite. What was your experience like? Um, it was amazing. He is so much fun to shoot with. Mm -hmm. A complete blast. We had so much fun on set. It was constantly jokes and pranks and this and that. I'm not sure if you like his excuse was he wasn't breaking character for the whole film. Right. <laughs> but, uh, and yeah. dancing, too. There's a lot of dancing, a lot too. Of dancing. So Isabel and, and uh, Kunal definitely get to shake a leg and do a bit for of volleyball. Sure. do. There, do so. one of the that scenes. Was my, that was my favorite part, I have to say. I love a dance break in a movie. Uh, any way you can get it in there. Listen, wherever there are Indian people, there's going to be song and dance because it's in everything that we do. So. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, it's so much fun to watch, you guys. And uh, now let's talk a little bit about uh, the importance of telling this story to a Canadian audience. Like I said, you know, um, it does talk about a really important issue, which is uh, the struggle for professional immigrants. Mm -hmm. But it also looks at the fact that, you know, like I said, we have a doctor shortage today. We have millions of people that don't have a family doctor. And we need to kind of figure out a way to kind of fast track international medical graduates. Um, there's that aspect of it. But also why it's important for Canadian audiences is because it's just a fun movie. Yeah. It's a fun movie. It's a cross-cultural movie. You're going to go out. Take your family, take your friends, and just kind of see something different. See some different people, see some different, you know, looking people on screen, and, yeah. uh, you know, and we're just having fun. Absolutely. You know, that's what it is. You can tell that you had fun for sure. I think we cut the footage off. There's a little risky yeah. scene there. You have to see it for yourself. <laughs> and of course, stay for the blooper reel as well at the end of the yes, show. Yes, oh, there, even I have Yes, seen there that. are some bloopers at the end with Kunal and me just going crazy and scenes that we didn't put in the film but yeah. and that's and you know what at the end of the day I think in uh, Canada we're really fortunate that we all celebrate each other we all mm -hmm. celebrate each other's cultures and this movie really has that you know we can poke fun at our little stereotypes and and you know so I just hope people have a good time on September 19th yeah take it yes. light and see Isabel dance oh <laughs> great, absolutely that is the ticket right there so beautiful thank you so thank much you so much. You. congratulations thank you so uh, much to for having you us. as well Dr. Cabby opens in theaters on Friday September the 19th a great comedy